glycine and on NAC. But why have they been in the news together? And why is it recommended that you take them together? Well, they're both precursors for glutathione, the most powerful antioxidant in the human body. Okay, so what is glutathione, also known as GSH? Well, it's a tripeptide. Tripeptides are peptides that are derived from three amino acids that are joined by two or three peptide bonds. Now, glutathione is formed from glutamine, which is the most abundant amino acid in the body, and two rate-limiting amino acids, glycine and cysteine, which we get from the NAC. Now, glutathione does a lot of the same things as cysteine. It's involved in detoxification, it improves insulin resistance, it's a neurotransmitter, it reduces inflammation, and it helps with thinning out mucus in the lungs. So honestly, I'm not sure whether we get these benefits directly from NAC or through NAC being synthesized into glutathione. But glutathione's primary impact stems from being an antioxidant. In fact, like I said, glutathione is the most powerful antioxidant in the human body. 